everyone, astrobiologist here to talk about the one and only place on Earth that nothing lives. So get on the magic school bus, kids. We're going to Dalal Pools. The Dalal Pools are in Ethiopia, and they're actually a hydrothermal vent system like Yellowstone Park. So they've got things like geysers and salt terraces and these big bright green pits of acid everywhere. Dalal is actually one of the most remote places on the planet. If you want to get there, you have to get on a train in another country, take that train out into the desert, get a camel, ride that camel for 17 miles, and then you will be there. Despite that, people actually used to live in Dalal. This is an abandoned mining town made completely of salt blocks where people used to live and mine potassium in abysmal conditions. But let's talk about the pools. A couple of years ago, even though the daily maximum temperature is about 116 degrees, a couple of scientists ventured out here to test the pools to see if anything lived there. And what they found was that, in fact, some of these pools are completely sterile. They're the only place on Earth there's no life whatsoever. So germs are really hardy, so this is kind of crazy because we have germs that live in boiling water. We have germs that live in really salty environment. We have germs that live in acids, but germs cannot survive all three of these things. Dalal's pools are what we call poly-extreme. They're extreme in multiple ways. In this case, they're hot, acidic, and very salty. It's kind of hard to conceptualize just how much of all three of those things they are, but let's try anyways. Dalal's pools are almost boiling, they're 12 times saltier than the ocean, and they're a thousand times more acidic than lemon juice all at once. That's wild. This place is rarely below 100 degrees, it's drier than the surface of Mars, it's full of weird pools that are hot and salty and so acidic that they could eat steel. It is truly the most toxic and uninhabitable place on the planet. But it's also weirdly beautiful. It's full of all these colors that you rarely see in nature, all these strange formations like this one. It's really cool. I hope I get to go one day. That's all for today. Feel free to drop any questions in the comments and I'll see you next time.